The Center for Hope and Healing is a program that is trying to new innovative ways to deliver care for individuals and families who have challenges with uncontrolled behavioral health conditions along with struggles in social health areas. Issues such as homelessness, food insecurity, transportation challenges and that sort of um, those sort of topics and what the Center for Hope and Healing does is bring together the resources so that all of these issues can be addressed in one place for the ease of the patient and their families. For individuals and families who are struggling with behavioral health, their social health, plus their medical health, I always think of it as almost drowning and not being able to get your head above water. There's just so much going on that without addressing these areas, you really can't get your head above water and live the life that you want to lead. And by putting resources in all one place, where an individual or a family can come, it makes it easy for them to come out of that crisis mode and start to manage their own health care and that health, the health of their families. The ultimate goal of the Center for Hope and Healing is really to assist people to get back on their feet again and to become independent in their lives. So what we do is we frequently see people who are in crisis situations or in near crisis situations and we bring them in as quickly as we can. We work with them to forge the relationships and to determine together as a team where the person wants to go with their lives and how we can support and get them there. At the Center for Hope and Healing, we have a phenomenal team. All of them, their heart is in the right area to really serve people who are struggling. In this program, we have the opportunity to work with not only individuals, but we can bring their family members on. And I think it's one of the few places in healthcare where we're treating the family member, however they define it, as a whole, which I think is important when you're looking at holistic health. The other thing is that you really get to know these, these patients or these clients, and you spend a lot of time with them. It is not the usual 15 or 20 minute visit. I'm the primary care physician. I get a whole hour with them as I start to work through their problems, their conditions, and I get to take the time to work with their specialists and figure out how does this really work for this person as a whole and what's realistic.